but we're a company that's organized around taking animal protein out of the food chain. We're looking at replacing animal protein where you can uh, with plant protein uh, in a way that is cost effective for consumers so they can have a very clean protein at a price that they can afford. A meat analog is a term that um, industry uses to describe a product that's meant to be a substitute for meat. We, however, at Beyond Meat think of ourselves a little bit differently. Uh, our sensory experience is not just a substitute, it's a perfect substitute in every way. So what's so special about Beyond Meat is it has a very similar nutritional profile compared to regular animal protein or chicken in our case and also has the texture and performance of, of real chicken. I mean, for me, that's one of the most uh, fun part about our job is, is going and, and meeting with food critics and, and chefs and, and trying to trick them. Probably the most satisfying uh, adventure in that area was working with Mark Pittman in the New York Times. We went to his place in New York and sat down with about seven different dishes, and one was made with, with meat and one was made with our plant-based products. I think two or three, he had a lot of difficulty telling us the difference, and I think he reported that as uh, they fooled me badly. I believe the reason that the founders, all of us, you know, founded this company, the reason we work here in this startup, in this office, the way that we do, uh, is because we really care about something other than just purely financial gain. I think everyone's here because in some way or another this is their life's work.